Hello everyone, long time no see. I'm sorry for the, you know, delayed amount of videos I've been, you know, lack of videos, I should say, sorry. I'm sorry for the lack of videos. I've just been extremely busy and, you know, flustered and overtaken with so many things. Working six days a week, 10 hour days, sometimes even 14 hour days, but there's no complaining, you know? There's no complaining. The only problems are the ones you make. But um, I hope everybody's been okay. I hope everybody's been great, been focused, and been setting their selves exactly where they need to be set. You know, following your purpose, following your goals. And it's crazy because that's what I want to talk about today is focusing on your main goal. Focusing necessarily on you know, your true purpose. And not necessarily, we don't have to say true purpose, but we can say, like, you know, what you want out of this life, your true your true goal. Focusing on that rather than looking at the finer things and running off with them, you know? Because so many people get so comfortable. For instance, let's use, let's use an analogy, right? We're gonna use an analogy. Say you're on a ship and the ship harbors at bay, right? The bay that you harbor at is not your final destination, but it is a short-term destination. It is a temporary destination. And whether you choose to harbor at this bay and choose to go full out and distract yourself and forget about the ultimate goal because you got so comfortable in the temporary goal, you got so distracted with, you know, minor details and minor things, minor feelings, minor experiences that they ended up overtaking and distracting you from what you truly are searching for. And, you know, things like that happen in life, whether it be a person, whether it be a an experience, a decision, all these things happen in life, you know? It's not subjected into just one thing, you know? Because everybody goes through different things and everybody experiences different things. Therefore, these minor distractions and takeaways can be of any genre, you know? doesn't necessarily have to be one thing. You know, it doesn't have to be just one person or, like I said, whatever you want it to be. These distractions and these things that take you away from your true purpose and your main goal come in all shapes and sizes, all different type of situations. It's not, you know, just one thing. But when you are confronted with this and you are, you know, you actually experience this, whether you're conscious of it or not, that's up to you. You should trust yourself and trust your intuition at will. And you always should. And just, you know, in general, I don't want to sound like I'm running around in circles, but in general, always focus on the main goal. If you want something in life, if you want to be in a certain place in life where you're financially free, where you're free of stress or just, you know, at peace with yourself. If you want to achieve that in life, you have to understand that it's not going to be easy and you're going to have to focus. You're going to have to discipline yourself and, and blend your mind into that of which you want, of which you are. Already adapt the mind that you adapt when you reach that point in life. Start to think like that even though you aren't there in life. Adapt that way of thinking, that way of being, so that when it comes, you are prepared. Nothing can break you because you are already prepared. You know that what you are experiencing is short term. Therefore, take it as a short-term thing and do not let it override you from your true potential and from the bigger picture.
You know? You're stronger than what you think of yourself to be. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise or take you away from thinking otherwise. Because you are more than what you think of yourself to be. You are what you think. You are what you speak. You are what you eat. It's a beautiful philosophy. It's a very beautiful philosophy. It's a beautiful chaos as well. <laughs> you can look at it like that too. It's just chaotic, but at the end of the day, it's beautiful. It goes with life as well. I'm like a kid fidgeting with all this mulch and stuff, but it's a beautiful day today, you know? And I thought I'd come up here and just talk to you guys because it's been so long. But circling back to the main topic, you know, focusing on your goal. When you come up with distractions, right? Let's just draw you a scenario. Because it's a common scenario that happens to, I don't know, I guess people my age or around my age or older. I'm only 20 years old, so let's assume around my age and older. In the setting, we're going to put the setting in college, I guess. Um, you're a kid in college. And you want to focus on the main goal. You know, maybe you want to be a doctor a lawyer, something, I don't know. I don't, I'm not on the school side, but, but let's say you want to be a doctor. You want to be a doctor, and to be a doctor, you have to do lots of years in school and lots of focus. You know, it requires lots of focus and attention to self and to what you are, you know, what's the word I'm looking for? Consuming. So you have to consume a lot of knowledge. Therefore, you have to be really focused and you cannot be distracted by minor things because once you get distracted by these minor things, then that thing takes you away from becoming what you want to be. You know, especially if you're in an environment where it's a bunch of distractions and that energy um, multiplies, the energy multiplies. Like, hey, dude, come on. Um, Let's go, let's go to this party, let's go drink, let's do this, let's do that. Those that that's a that's a typical distraction, you know, when you're trying to be your best and going out there to be your best, there's always gonna be that person or persons that distract you and try to take you away from becoming that of what you want to be. This always happens. This is a common occurrence. And whether you fall for it or not is up it's ultimately up to you it's ultimately up to you it shows your character if you take it as okay nah ah uh, you know nah i'm good man i don't no no thank you i'm all right you know or okay i will you know that that just shows character whether you're peer pressured into it or or you feel like you should because you will get, you know, some type of praise from it. I don't know how people think in that environment. I don't, you know, it's ignorant me talking about it because I've never been in it. I've never been in that situation to begin with. So it's kind of ignorant to begin with, you know, but it's just a little example because I know it's a common occurrence where people want to do better in life. And then there's another person that comes in their life that tries to take them away from being better in life. But yet this person knows that they have to take this person out of their life in order to evolve. Yet they still continue to have this person in their life. So while they're trying to swim, they're also drowning. It's a confusing. It's a confusing thing. But that's just the human experience, you know. You want to do better, but you're not allowing yourself to do better. You are being your own enemy because you are the one that controls your whole reality so why allow yourself to continue to sink whilst trying to swim it doesn't make sense to me i guess it's not supposed to make sense to me but don't spend time don't spend time trying to understand something you're not meant to understand for instance, I used to try to understand and get why people like going to these parties or, or you know, drinking or, or just being ignorant. And, and I don't know. It never resonated with me. So 
I had to come to the realization that, you know, why am I trying to understand why people act a certain way? You know what I'm saying? Why am I trying to understand why people act like this? I should be focused on how I'm acting. And that's the only thing I should worry about is how I'm acting and what I'm doing with my life. You know, I don't care what these people are doing with their lives because it doesn't resonate with me. I'm not gaining anything from seeing how these people go about their life. You know, I can't learn from them. I'd rather put my attention and interest into somebody I can gain something from and learn from rather than somebody I'm gaining nothing from. It's a bunch of people that are the same and there's ones that aren't the same. So the one that's a part of the group, you know, the ones that are a part of the whole group versus the one that isn't a part of the group, the ones that have their head down and the one that has their head up. I'd rather listen to the one that has his head up versus the people that are all in the same, you know, race and circle because I can't gain anything from them. So take that as an example. Take that as you will, what I just said. Um, because don't take advice from somebody that's not doing better in life than you. You know what I'm saying? You don't. You can't learn anything from them. You can't learn from these people. So take advice from yourself and those that you want to aspire to be like. You know what I'm saying? Don't try to understand why people are a certain way only understand why you are you and why you are how you are that will save you a lot of stress and a lot of free thinking sorry if my hair looks crazy i i didn't you know i just woke up my hair was like this so i didn't care this is me you know you you're on this channel to 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 listen to me and, and experience me in my raw in true form so that's where i'm giving you i'm not gonna i don't edit my videos none of this and that if you're new to this i don't edit my videos i don't do any of that stuff i just come up here turn my camera on and i speak my mind you know i help you and i help me because me making these videos helps me in the sense of as i'm speaking i'm listening you know but I do appreciate every single one of you guys for, you know, tuning in and just listening and hopefully gaining something from this because you don't know me, but you still give me your energy and time to listen to me and try to gain something from me. I'm only 20 years old, you know, I'm really, I don't know anything. I'm just learning as I go. So it means a lot to know that you know people are listening to me and my messages are getting across because it's only up from here you know i'm winning you're winning i go up you go up this isn't a i'm gonna go up and you know i'm not gonna help nobody nah heck nah forget that that's not how life works that's not how life is that's selfish that's a selfish way of living We are humans. We are supposed to help one another, love one another, not put down one another. That's the ego, and that's a selfish way of thinking, and it sucks because that's how this world has come to be for the most part. You know? I wouldn't even say the most part. This world is so big. There's so many people of different, you know... Yeah, it's whatever you put your energy into. If you put your energy into negativity, then you will get negativity. If you put your energy into positivity, then you will experience positivity. You know, we are magnets of energy. So what you put your energy into is what you get back. So never speak ill of self and always speak positive of self and always look for the positive things in life. Even though I understand it's hard at times because there's It can get foggy and it can get muggy, but always choose to look and aspire and search for the positive things in life. Because those those things will set you free. It will truly set you free. What time am I at? 15 minutes is a good video, long, good video. But like I said, I'm gonna wrap it up here with this. Focus on your main goal. 
focus on yourself focus on your main goal do not let minor distractions take you away from the bigger picture because once it takes you away from the bigger picture then you become consumed by these little minor distractions and once you get consumed by these minor distractions then you forget the whole purpose you forgot why you started in the first place you got too comfortable you got too distracted you forgot why you started in the first place don't let anybody take you away from being your true self do not let anybody take you away from what you want. You are in control of your life, not them. Not them. They will never be in control of your life. The only power they have is the only power you give them. Do not let anybody control your life. Stay true to yourself. Love. Love yourself. Love one another. Choose peace, choose happiness, and you will set and you will be set free. I promise you. That is, it doesn't get so much simpler than that. It does not get so much simpler than that. But I leave the video there. Um, yeah, and something I'm working on. This is not like I don't. It's not a plug, but I've been working on you know a brand and stuff. You know, making clothes and stuff. If you want to check it out, there's nothing there, but I just, I don't have Instagram, but I did make an Instagram for it. So I'll just put that in the description. I also put the website in the description if you want to check it out. I have one shirt that I'm just been promoting, but yeah, sorry about that plug. I, I know you guys aren't here for that, but you know, I like to get the word out. If anybody wants to, you know, um, if it piques your interest, I guess. I'm not trying to sell you anything. I'm just trying to show you something. But, yeah. As every uh, as it goes, as it goes. The sun has just risen. I hope you have a good day, good experience. If the night has just fallen, I hope you have a good night, some good dreams, some good rest. And as always and ever. Sorry. Always and forever. It's been me. It's been Prenti. I love you guys so much. Thank you for everything you've done for me. You know, thank you for the messages. I read all your comments. Trust me. I read everything. But, yeah. I'll see y'all when I see y'all.